Hi learners! I'm Sir Noy and welcome to Math Bilang. This is the part 2 of our video series about perimeter. In this video, it will help you learn the art of measuring figures and objects around us using our weight tools. This is Kate. She wanted to put a lace on her handkerchief. She wanted to find out how much ribbon she would need. What units should Kate use to measure the handkerchief? What tool would she use? A ruler is used to measure short objects or distances, such as the length of a desk. A meter stick measures in inches, feet, or meters. A football field measures in meters. You have to move a meter stick 120 times to measure the length of a football field. Kate is measuring a short distance. Kate can measure in inches using her ruler. The measure of her handkerchief is 8 inches long and 6 inches wide. How will she get the perimeter of the handkerchief? Simply add all the length of each side of the handkerchief to get the perimeter. So 8 plus 6 plus 8 plus 6 equals 28 inches. Kate needs 28 inches of ribbon to put it around her handkerchief. Let's have these examples. Example number 1. A rectangular lot which is 12 meters long and 5 meters wide. What is the appropriate tool I will use? And the tool that we are going to use is a meter stick. Let's find the perimeter. So P equals 12 plus 5 plus 12 plus 5. And the perimeter is 34 meters. Example number 2. I have a scale and triangle that measures 14 centimeters, 36 centimeters, and 30 centimeters on its sides. What tool will you use to measure its perimeter? And what is its perimeter? So P equals 14 plus 36 plus 30 gives you 80 centimeters. So 80 centimeters is the perimeter of the scale and triangle. A ruler can be used to measure centimeters. Let's have an activity. What appropriate tool will you use to measure the following objects? Ruler or meter stick? For shoebox, we will use ruler. For 20 peso bill, we will use ruler. For basketball court, we will use meter stick. For an umbrella, we will use a ruler. For a blackboard eraser, we will use ruler. For cell phone, we will use ruler. For bed broom, we will use meter stick. And for garden plot, we will use a meter stick. Very good! How about this another activity? Directions. If you are to measure the following figure for real, what tool ruler or meter stick and unit of measure meter centimeter or inches will be use the tool that we are going to use to measure the house is a meter stick and the unit is meter number two the tool that we are going to use to measure the bag is a ruler and the unit is inches Number 3. The tool that we are going to use to measure the window is a meter stick and the unit meter. Number 4. The tool that we are going to use to measure the lampshade is a ruler and the unit is inches. How about this activity? Directions. Choose the pay tool to use ruler or meter stick to get the perimeter of the following. It's time to check your work. 
Number one, the answer is meter stick. Number two, it's a ruler. Number three, it's a meter stick. Number four, a ruler. And number five, a ruler. It's time to test yourself. Give the appropriate tool in measuring the perimeter of the following. Let's check your work. Number one, the tool that we are going to use to measure the door is a meter stick. And the perimeter is 6 meters. Number two, the tool that we are going to use to measure the blackboard is a meter stick. And the perimeter is 10 meters. Number three, the tool that we are going to use to measure the pizza slice is a ruler and the perimeter is 15 centimeters. Number four, the tool that we are going to use to measure the picture frame is a ruler and the perimeter is 20 inches. Thank you so much for listening and watching this video. I hope that this video helped you in your mojo. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Happy learning!